On today's show, who are you when you're hungry? Hello and welcome back to Saving the Flavor. We try the foods that you don't have to unless you want to. I'm your host, Stephen White, and with me, as always, is Katrina. Uh, we actually have stumbled upon, and you may have seen the ads on television, which caught our eye, of three new Snickers flavors that are on the market. Now, Snickers has had a few different flavors on the market. They've had like a peanut butter, they've had almonds, they've had dark, I believe. Mm -hmm. So these are actually something completely different. We have really no idea where the flavoring is in place. So we don't know if it's, it's added to the chocolate, we don't know if it's added inside the bar. So this is gonna be a unique experience for all of us. We're all gonna be experiencing this at the same time. So. Why don't we crack open some stickers and find out if they're any good? All right, first we have uh, sweet and salty, and it says indecisive. If you also are familiar with the Snickers campaign here lately, they all have some little something now, so it doesn't say Snickers, but you get the idea. I'm gonna guess this one is going to be, have like pretzels or something in it. Yeah. Which I, isn't really a super like mind blowing concept because no. there's a lot of candy bars that already have pretzels in them. But we're gonna cut this in half, and this way we can actually see it and then split it between us. Now, if you look in it, it looks like peanuts in there. Yeah. So, which is already in a Snickers bar, but the I'm guessing that is still nougat at the bottom. I see caramel, peanuts, and nougat, which yeah. is all in a normal <laughs> Snickers bar. So, I don't see anything <laughs> mind blowing, you know, out the gate just in the cross section. So, we'll have to try it and see where the sweet and salty comes in. <laughs> sea salt, yeah, they just really kind of layered it up with sea salt. You can actually taste like chunks of sea salt in there as you're taking bites. Not a huge difference between a normal Snickers and that one. It gives you a little something extra from a Snickers. Next we have espresso. And a little coffee bean there. <laughs> so I expect this to have a deep coffee flavor within the chocolate. They could surprise me and put they put real coffee beans in there? That's gonna be just like, ah, mind blowing. That would be awesome. But something tells me they're not gonna be so smart to do so. I don't see coffee beans. No, nope, still looks like Ooh, a Snickers. You can smell it. It's in the chocolate, I'm telling you. Still looks like a Snickers, but the coffee flavor is just emanating from it. So I'm expecting to bite into it and get a real coffee heavy chocolate flavor. Yep. So. Mm -hmm. It's built in to the chocolate so well, too. Such a great blend of a Snickers with a coffee flavor. Something with a Snickers, it just elevates it. It's so much, it's really good. And finally, we have Fiery. This is a um, chili chocolate, I'm going to assume. I'm not a fan of chocolate and chilies, mm. you know, the combination. I love them separately. Together, not so much. I'm excited about it. Can't really smell anything. No, and it still looks like a Snickers inside. I feel like the, the peppers are hiding in there, especially mm -hmm. in the chocolate, because when we bite it, that's where the heat's gonna come from. That's where we're gonna catch it, and it's gonna be like, whoa, what was that? What are you doing? You can't cheat. Take a bite. I'm licking it because I'm really wondering if it's in the chocolate or if it's in the nougat. Mmm. Never know. Let's find out. Mm-mm. In the nougat. I can feel it on the on the sides of my tongue. It's in the nougat. <laughs> for sure. And the more you chew, you're just kind of knocking it around a little bit. That one. This was a tough call. If you like spicy chocolate, you you'll probably like this. Uh, I'm not really a fan, so I'm not really digging it. I like it. <laughs> I don't like that. I don't like that out of candy. That's just my personal preference. Uh, as far as me, personally, the espresso takes the cake in this contest. If they're doing a contest, I don't know. They might just be trying new things out. But the espresso for me was top notch. That was the best Snickers. Fiery. <laughs> I like the espresso. They did an espresso fiery one. 
just be the best of both worlds. Mm -hmm. Is there such a thing? I don't know. All you coffee drinkers out there, tell me, is there is there a spicy coffee? That just seems like a bad idea. I don't know. There's like a lot of funky coffees. I remember hearing about one that's like made out of cat poop. Gross. Isn't there one made out of elephant dung? Probably. Probably. We might do that on the show if we ever found it, but I doubt it. I just... <laughs> I don't know if I could do that. Maybe you and... Uh, George? Yeah. Maybe. Mm -hmm. Maybe I'll drag him on for something yeah. special like that. He would do like it. He would, he would, do, he would it. do it He'd for totally sure. He would totally do it. Well, there you have it. The three new Snickers on the market gave you our opinions. Let us know what you think. If you want to go out and try these for yourself, let us know if you enjoyed them or not. And just remember, if you want to support the show, you can go to patreon.com slash pencil and paper productions, chuck in a buck, and uh, help us out. We can do more shows like this on a regular basis. But anyway, guys, thank you for joining us, and we'll see you next time.